Hi everyone, it's Danny here from Angel Handmade Papercraft. Today I am working with the Hedgehog Hollow and I am using the September 2019 sub box. So this is everything that comes in the kit and this is the pretty little card that I have made. So let's get started. So I am using the feather envelope seals and I'm also using the feather background and peacock. So I'm starting with one of these envelope seals. I have cut down the blue cardstock and the vellum piece from the kit and I'm just using a lawn fawn stitched circle die. I'm just putting some washi tape on my hand to make it not so sticky. I've just ran that through my Sizzix Big Shot. My plan is to emboss the Scorgeous Infinity stamp onto the vellum. Um, and then I'm going to stamp the sentiment below. So I'm using my uh, powder tool to prepare the vellum first, using some ink on three um, embossing ink and some super fine white detail embossing powder from Ranger, and just heating that up with my heat tool. Just being very, very careful. This is vellum and it will melt easily. So I'm just, I've turned the image over and I'm just using my RV52 Copic to add some pink to that infinity. Just rubbing off a little area there where my marker decided to bleed. All right, so I'm just working out all of my layers here. I did uh, fold down one of those card bases that came in the kit as well. And I'm stamping the sentiment out and doing the same thing again. So just melting all that down. I just used a lawn fawn acrylic block to stamp those out. Just making sure everything is nice and straight before I pop it onto my card. And I am just using all of the feathers out of the second stamp set. And I'm going to use my embossing ink once again. And I am going to stamp those all the way around the outside of the card. Trying to leave the center where I'm going to pop that circle blank. Um, because I didn't want those to show through the vellum. So I was going to try and leave it. But I decided to use some clear embossing powder. Um, and I sprinkled that all over and then I'm going to heat set it. So it does give it that embossed look when you um, move the cardstock into the light. And it looks really, really pretty in real life. So I do apologize. It's not so easy to see. Here you can see it beautifully. Um, and I'm going to add some Tombow Mono Multi just behind those areas of the sentiment and behind the little infinity so that you can't see them. Just cleaning off my desk as I go. So I'm going to add some square glue dots to the back of the blue cardstock, adhering that down to the vellum. And then I will add some more to the back of the vellum and popping that down evenly on my card. And yes, of course, I stuck it the wrong way around. So I had to very quickly pull that off before the glue dots pushed down too much. And now I was totally not happy with the way that the pink um, Copic didn't show through that infinity symbol. So I've just grabbed some of my Sharpies. This is the Electro Pop collection and I just used the electric pink. So this is my card all complete. I thank you all for watching. I do have all of the details about subscribing to the uh, sub box um, on my blog and below this video will be some links. So check those out. Uh, thank you for watching and see you soon. Bye.